All right, everybody, we're back down here at Picker Hollow. We're up on the uh, inlet side here. We're gonna be working up past my shoulder back here, but uh, turn you around here real quick. I got the spot here set up with the sluice. We're gonna walk up the creek here. And I've been having dreams about this spot. Ed's found two pickers here at the beginning of the year. I've totally demolished the area. But I want to punch down through the clay and see if there's any gravels. As you can see here, I'm walking on bedrock. This is all bedrock. Coming up here, still on bedrock. Zoom. There you go. You can see all this is bedrock. Of course, there's a bunch of beautiful cracks through here. Nice little beautiful pit right there. Might be something in there. But... Right about here is where our overburden starts, where our material starts. So from here, we're gonna work back, probably this coming spring, all the way up back up over here. We're gonna dredge this, Ed, Ed wants to do it. Chris Dyer has talked about it, so I think we'll get a nice little system going and just eat all this away. And you see you got a nice little natural waterfall right here little part of it there I've done a couple test pans here found some good gold under it done some digging there found some good gold took out this whole area here but I want to punch through Ed found his pickers about right in here and I want to clear out some of these bigger rocks and just dig down and even all the way through the clay and see if I can get some gravels or if I hit bedrock first so that's the goal for today. Well, we're on our first pail here. Water's a little murky, but there is a piece of gold right there. I haven't seen any other ones yet, but you never know, there's a piece of metal there. But we're gonna run the rest of this bucket and see what we get. All right, well we finished that bucket. I see a little piece right there. See it right there. There was a piece over here, but I think it's buried. Check this other side. No. Up here and check this. There's a couple pieces. A nice little piece. There's a few pieces up there. Let's hope there's some down here in this stuff. We'll go do another bucket. We're still trying to get down to the bedrock. Right now we're just digging through some clay, which the clay has a lot of rocks and stuff like that mixed in with it. So that's probably why we're still finding gold. We'll see if we can get to bedrock. All right, well, water's a little murky because I was working upstream. <coughs> but I still got some pieces of gold in there. We got another bucket ready, about half a bucket, maybe a little over half. We're gonna run it, and then we'll do a clean out and see what all we got. All right, well, the bucket is empty. Yeah, nice piece there. It might be a couple pieces together. And we got a few pieces up there. So let's uh, put it all into our bucket, and uh, go ahead and pan it out and see what we get. All right, well, it was a total of about a five gallon bucket, maybe six gallons total. But we got it all cleaned up. That don't look too bad. A couple nice pieces in there, a couple smaller ones. Save for a five gallon bucket, that's not too bad. We're gonna go up here and dig a little bit more and see what else we can find. So I'm walking back up the creek here. It's all nice and clear again. Let's kind of see how deep our hole is getting. Oh, 
not too bad. Let's clean all that out of there and uh, do another pan. Or another pan, another bucket, sorry. All right. Well, we got our third bucket. Probably be our last bucket. It's taking a while to dig this stuff through that clay and then break the clay down. But water's a little hazy. The sluice has been cleaned out. So we're going to run this right here, a little over a half a bucket, and it's literally just clay. So hopefully we don't get too clogged up, and we'll see what kind of gold we're getting out of just the clay. Beautiful day out today. It was like 56 for a high in the middle of December. I'll take that any day of the year. Warm enough for me to get out here in the creek, do a little prospecting, have a little bit of time to myself, enjoying nature, and finding some shiny. I feel like a little kid making mud pies. I keep hearing weird sounds like thunder, but there's no rain in the forecast till tomorrow. Weird. Where did it go? Who knows? Add a little water to my bucket just to kind of keep some of the mud down, make it more of a liquid instead of a muddy mess. That way it doesn't stick to my gold and pull it out of the sluice. A little bit more mess here, but it is what it is. Not seen anything yet.
gonna run the rest of this, and then I'll bring you back online and show you the clean out. Oh, it'll fall. All right, well, we finished that bucket. I'm not too satisfied. I only seen one piece of gold in here. It's right there. There might be a couple more pieces in there, but I didn't really see too many of them. I only seen that one, so I think we still got a little bit of time. We'll run up here and try to classify another bucket before we get out of here. That's how deep the hole is. Zoom you guys out here. Kind of see. Pretty good sized little hole there. But gold started kind of petering out. I only got one one piece of gold basically in that entire bucket so i think what we're gonna do is we're gonna jump right out into here and just scrape some of this stuff off the top here oh well, we're back down at the sluice and i see one two little pieces of gold up there that's all the gold i see so let's run this and hope there's some more in it all right so we finished that bucket so it's been the fourth half bucket today. We got it in the sluice. We're gonna let that clear out a little bit. We're gonna take the rest of our stuff up to the truck, except for the snuffer bottle and pan. Well, our book bag and stuff is up the creek. We're gonna grab that stuff, take it up to the truck, which is right up there. And then we'll come back down and clean out the sluice and see what kind of gold we got. This right here is the metal and glass that we pulled out of the creek today of it Let's see. Show that one, two, three. Looks like four sitting up there now. Well, let's clean it out and see what we got. All right, so the sluice is all cleaned out. We got it in our pan. Let's go pan it out. See some metal showing up in there. Zoom you guys in a little bit here. All right, I'm not very good at doing this one-handed. I see a couple pieces. There's one, there's one, there's one. And there's one up at the top. So, looks like we got four pieces. I'll finish panning this down and see what we actually got in here. Well, it wasn't very much. Looks like six, six pieces maybe five pieces nope six pieces there's one over there one two three four five six i'll get this snuffed up pack this up to the truck and then i'll show you guys what we got for the day well there it is guys some nicer little pieces some small little pepper pieces and then some little fly poop 
And of course we got some lead and then all the metal and glass we pulled out. But I'm glad you all came along this time for this adventure. Uh, I'm hoping to get back here a couple more times before the end of the year. Today is the 11th of December. It was a beautiful day, great outside, wearing just the hoodie and the waders. But I'm going to get out of here, and until the next time, be safe and have a golden day.